One of our favorite and we think most useful hacks for building with the empty conduit are these threaded inserts that you can put in the end of conduit to add a threaded point in your conduit builds. And today I wanna to show you a really cool solution which is adding a similar thing in the sidewall of EMT conduit. There's a lot of cool possibilities with this. You can even combine the two and I'll show you that later and you know, kinda of talk about what's possible with that. But this is a really cool solution that came from William a couple years ago and it all utilizes this really cool tool that you can get pretty inexpensively at Harbor Freight. I'm sure there are nicer ones out there that you can get but this one worked well in the limited times I've used it so far. And this essentially is this threaded insert riveter kit. And it came with this tool and uh, a few different inserts. You can see the threads there below each section of the different sizes that it came with. But one cool uh, insert that it came with was quarter 20, which works really well with our quarter 20 insert for the end of the MT conduit. So that's awesome that it came with that. And I'm gonna show you guys how to put these in. But essentially you just have this, once you have it completed, you have this threaded nut in the sidewall of EMT that you could thread bolts into uh, in different accessories and you can utilize those different ones there for other accessories that you might have and want to incorporate. And it's pretty easy, a lot easier than I expected it to be to install it. And essentially you just want to put it in a vise if you've got one handy, otherwise you can probably just clamp it to the side of your workshop table or you know somewhere that you're able to drill. And if you want to keep the drill bit from walking all over the place, you can use a tool like this. This just adds this point. We actually highlighted this in an episode a few weeks back. But it just adds that point in the EMT conduit, which helps the drill bit stay in place. But essentially, for this size insert, for the quarter 21 that comes with this, and it may be the case for all of them, but I've only done this one, you just want to drill a 3 8 inch hole in the sidewall of the EMT conduit. And when you're drilling something like this, you just want to do a low speed, but a, a high pressure uh, whenever you're drilling through EMT. Until you get all the way through just like that. And then you want to take the, the tool the rivet tool and you want to take and thread on the insert and you have to change out the stud based on which one you're putting in but it comes with the quarter 21 standard on there that must be the most common one they assume people are going to use but essentially you just put this in inside the the hole here i'm going to take it out of the vise i found this really helpful if you just put it flat on something because you have to squeeze this handle pretty hard but essentially the insert goes in there like that and then you just squeeze this handle and what's that is, what's that is doing on the inside and you have to unthread this too. They have this cool built-in thing so you can just quickly uh, take it out. You don't have to spin the whole handle around or the, the conduit or whatever it is that you're adding this into. But essentially what this is doing on the inside, and I'll show you here in a second, is it's adding a knurl on the inside, on the opposite side, so it's kind of squeezing the conduit wall in between those two pieces. And I don't know if you can see that in there, but essentially it's just adding that neural in there and like I said, just squeezing this and that's what's securing this in place, which is really awesome. And like I said, a lot of cool possibilities. If you've got a bolt, you just want to you know, add something, an accessory to the sidewall of EMT, add an eye hook or something so you can hook onto things in your build. Really cool possibilities. And one of the ones I think is really awesome is being able to combine these with the threaded inserts for the end of EMT conduit, thread these two things together. And just like that, you've got this <laughs> pretty much frame connection point between these two pieces here and you can build frames like that too. So a lot of cool possibilities. Thanks so much to William for sharing this. Hope you guys enjoyed it and found it useful. If you did leave a like and consider subscribing. Thanks so much for watching. See you in the next one.